Hi guys, over the past few, today is Monday the 30th, I believe, of March, day four of the Great Curfew. And uh, over the past, mm, call it 10 days or so, uh, many Saitlanders leaders have been contacting me from all over South Africa to ask for advice on this or an opinion on that, or whether I know something about the other, if I've got some inside information or some good intelligence or so on. Anyway, in all of those conversations, one or two leaders have asked me to produce a video telling people not to panic, which is very easy to do. And quite honestly, I'm sorry that I couldn't do it before now, but the past you know, 10 days or so have been frantic. This is an easy video. We're not promising that everything is going to be hunky-dory. But our leader, Mr. Miller, is not panicking. I've spent a lot of time with him over the past seven or eight days. He's not panicking. Um Jan van Amerva is not panicking. Colonel Veinam Tutoy is not panicking. Kuni Maria, who runs our organization on a day-to-day -day basis and has, has his finger on the pulse of everything that's going on, is not panicking. I am not panicking. We don't know how this thing is going to pan out. It may not be hunky-dory, but for now, it's quite simple. We are all at our homes. Everything is peaceful. We are prepared. We are better prepared than most other people. And we will play things by ear. If circumstances change, we will adapt to them accordingly. For instance, if anarchy broke out, Mr. Miller would then take a decision based upon the, uh, uh, the extent of the crisis uh, regarding the implementation of our Nord plan. There's no cause for panic. Remember that you are Saitlanders. Remember that you are Christian believers who are prepared for this hour. <clears throat> Excuse me. We'll keep in touch with you. We'll feed through any information that we get. You'll be hearing a lot from us. Don't worry. Thank you and God bless you.